Hello. All right. So I figured it has been quite a while. And in order for me to start in on crystal, I need to be not just emerald, but also violet. And I have not played Violet in quite a while. I don't remember where we were. It looks really cute, though. I don't remember that being the beginning screen. I think because I had it just going and... Oh, look at us. We're adorable. We really are. Okay. It's the bathroom. Okay, fun. Here's our friend. I don't remember her name. She's much taller than us. We gotta go to the schoolyard. Director's orders. Okay. Let's go to the schoolyard. Excellent. Seems everyone is here. How would you tell? Well then, it's time I explained your independent study assignment. As usual, the theme will be a treasure hunt. I asked each of you to set out and travel the world in search of your own treasure. I ask each of you. You've all learned so much within the walls of our fine academy. I just got here. Now it is time to turn your eyes upon the wider world and deepen your understanding. Explore Paldea's abundant nature, soak in its rich culture, discover the Pokemon that live here, and get to know the people, too. Where will you travel? Who will you meet? And what will you achieve? Of course, your Pokemon partners will be there to help you. Your journey, you will journey together, learn new things together, Share each other's thoughts and feelings, and find something you might always treasure. <clears throat> I look forward to welcoming you all back after your independent study, when you return to us as fine young trainers. Hmm. Let the treasure hunt begin. Onward. I thought it was going to be a fun treasure hunting school event. This sounds fucking lame. And like a cop-out. <laughs> Take care, everyone. And remember, the great crater of Paldea is exceedingly dangerous. Entering it is a violation of school rules. Is that the first thing we're doing? What are you waiting for? Let's go! Okay. We weren't given a deadline for this, were we? Oh my god. Yeah, there we go. Hi, baby. What? Oh. The treasure hunt! It's finally starting! What are we supposed to do? Yeah, fair question, since it's your first time. Come on, let's walk and talk. The treasure hunt is a huge part of the Yuva Academy school year. The point isn't to get us all looking for some actual hidden treasure, necessarily. We're more just making our own adventures to see what it what experiences Paldea's got to offer. 
You could try to be Pokemon gyms. You could help out people in need. You could hunt for real capital T treasure if you wanted, even. But there's stuff we'd never learn sitting in a classroom, you know? This is our chance to learn it. Okay. You're way more excited about this than I am. Hello, how are you? Plus, there's so many chances to battle, which is obviously perfect for me. I'm good, thanks. Just started in. You and me are for sure gotta battle if we run into each other out there. Hope you're ready. Sure. I'm good as well? Good! Oh yeah, battling can wait. I meant to tell you. Did you know your phone's map app lets you set yourself- uh, lets you set yourself destinations? No, I did not. You could try setting one of the gyms as your destination. That'd get you on your way easy. How's that for a student council president? Giving your own friends an insider advantage? Jeez, Arvin, chill out. Hey, Arvin? He looks like an adult. <laughs> Both of these look like adults. Do you want any Pokemon? I'm all set, but thank you. Insider advantage? Sheesh, you make it sound like we're cheating or something. All I did was suggest that she check out the gyms. It's up to Jade whether she goes. Jade's gonna have her hands full searching out Titan Pokemon with me. She doesn't have time to waste on something like chasing after the champion rank. Oh, Jesus. Me and her are gonna be too busy visiting the lairs of Titans and nabbing their... Herba Mystica. I don't remember signing up for either of these. And Sirio? Don't go fill filling her head with weird stories. Hey, all I did was invite her along. It's still up to Jade whether she goes, right? <sighs> hmm? Your phone's ringing. Oh, thank God. Who is it? Is it my mom? Hey, Ca Cassiopeia? Cassiopeia? I still don't know how to pronounce this. It's about Operation Starfall. Remember what I told you before? Team Star is made up of five individual squads, and each one's got their own base. I need you to go to each base, all five of them, and beat the squad boss there. Team Star's grunts might try to get in your way, but I'll be helping you out from a distance. And heads up that the bosses each specialize in a different Pokemon type. Just remember the names of their crews, and you'll figure it out. Still, no need to worry. With your skills, I'm sure you're more than up to the task. I'll just go ahead and add the base, add the base's locations to your phones for you. Phone for you. Oh shit. Team Star bases have been added to your map app. Lucky me. Turn this up for me a little bit. I can't really hear it. Good luck with those bosses. I'll hook you up with some more nice reward with some nice rewards every time you beat one. Wait one second. Who are you supposed to be? Team Star, those punks are a serious hazard. They're not her problem. That's right, because she's got more important things to do, like searching out awesome ingredients with me. I thought it was up to her to decide whether she goes or not. Wasn't that what you said, Nimona? And Arvin? How do you know my... I'm looking forward to seeing what you can pull off. Bye. What was that all about? I'm glad you're making plenty of friends here, but try not to get dragged into anything dangerous. Anyway, no more weird vibes. We've got a big adventure to start. I'm gonna battle every single Pokemon trainer I meet. If I just keep trying to become the strongest, I bet that I can experience... I bet that experience will be the thing I treasure. She sounds like a Kingdom Hearts character, and I don't like it. Guess I'll start by heading to a gym and training up some new Pokemon. Here, I'll send you a pic of what gym buildings look like. Jeez. Oh, that is weird. I'm glad you showed me because I was like, I know what a gym looks like. I guess I don't. Oh, and I know we've been running our mouths, but it's your call what to do. Go where you want and do what 
do what it is you really want to do the most. The treasure of our very own. For me, that's got to be my, uh, my big dream of tracking down the Herba Mystica, of course. Once we get those herbs, I'll make you the absolute best sandwich you've ever had in your life. That does sound nice. Hello. Ugh. What'd you come out for? Oh my gosh. Did you come out because you said... S Did it just come out because you said sandwich? <laughs> well, you're not getting one. Oh. Seems like it wants to start moving. Is it telling you to get on? Press the... Ah. E button to jump. <gasps> you can jump? Oh, hell yeah. It looks like a motorcycle. Whoa, it transformed! No, it really looks like some kind of weird... Oh boy. Cyclozar? As long as you've got Maraden, you can go pretty much anywhere. Miradon? Probably. Lady is your cloister. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe. Well, if you're going to search for those Titan Pokemon, I'd say set out from the East Gate. But since Jade is actually headed to take on some gyms, I'd say go for the West Gate. Besides, it's way e it's way too easy to get lost out east. Man, this is why I can't get along with you. I'm out of here. Catch up soon, little buddy. I'll head to the gym. See you around. I think I'm gonna go with Arvin. Nimona's just too pushy. Okay, how do I... There we go. Oh my god. Home ec class? Damn it, that breaks the curse. I don't know what's going on. I should not have taken as big of a break from this game as I did because I have no idea what's going on. Jump. Oh! Oh my god. Uh, sure. I have no idea what's going on. See, we have some energetic young ones in our class this time around. You may call me Mr. Saguaro. Time here with me will be spent attaining knowledges. I already regret this. Many of you have left the care of your parents to live here. Yes. Pray that the knowledge I impart to you will improve the quality of your lives and the necessities thereof. Food, clothing, and shelter. Those three categories, I assume the most pressing and interesting for you all is food. When you eat sandwiches on your picnics, the HP of your party Pokemon will be restored. Okay, I, I now understand that this is kind of a, a way to explain things to you without getting too in the way. Oh no. Well, must you keep in mind to receive even more helpful... of ingredients. Yeah, I should have known.
I... I don't... <laughs> this is too much. I don't want this right now. Just leave and train or something. It's it's the one thing I know how to do. Gate this is. But I am leaving through it, so. Oh my gosh, there are so many of you. Hi. How are you? What's the shiny thing? Oh. Oh, sorry. Hmm. All right, this one is on its own. One of you. I'm actually not sure. Yes, you do. Alright. Who is that? Oh, yes, of course. Mm -hmm. I don't think I need that. Congratulations, Ralts. We'll switch it with Dolphin, I think. Yeah, that's the one. Alright. Oh yeah, I forgot that we get stuff now. Yeah, I don't know, this is a very interesting direction for Pokemon, but I'm not entirely sure how I feel about it. Did you know? Press the ZL button, you can walk onto a nearby Pokemon. Oh. I didn't know that, so I appreciate it, thank you. Oh, so cute. I do really hate that I can't, like... 
There we go. Oh, no. Perfect timing. You wanted to challenge me to a Pokemon battle, right? Sure. Carlotta the student. Oh! That thing's so cute! up and got smacked down. Alright. What on earth are you? Oh yes, you're that little spider. Small. A chewle? Choodle. Choodle. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, uh, I don't want to kill you. I, I would like. Okay, that'll do. The visual does make it, like, interestingly, so that I do want to collect Pokemon, which I don't normally have any interest in doing. Have we been here? Oh, we have been here. Is this where we started? I like that you don't have to talk to anybody directly to... Holy shit, that thing's huge. Is that canonically how large Pelipper has always been? That is terrifying. This is where we started. My bad. I can do that well. Oh, hell yeah. That makes this so easy. Did I just get candy?
So I guess we do have to pick a south, an east or a west. So cute. Still so weird that you can't go into every single one of them. <gasps> A spoink! Oh my god. I love spoinks, they're so cute. This is Jade's phone, right? It's me, Arvin. I was a bit worried about whether or not you managed to set out yet. You did end up deciding to set out east, right? After leaving the school? If so, you're not that far from the area where Stony Cliff Titan is said to make its lair. Stories say it clings to cliffs, practically becomes part of the stone, then attacks from above. Though, maybe don't be staring up overhead all the time looking for a titan, only to go tumbling off some cliff you didn't see. If that ever does happen, you can open up your map app and call yourself a flying taxi to pick you up. Some of those rocky areas are like a real maze. Try not to get lost, little buddy. And if you find a titan, let me know. Okay. Thanks, Urban. The way you are smiling, you have too many teeth, my friend. Just went shopping for sandwich ingredients and bought more than I could use. Mind taking some? I don't mind at all. Thanks. Here you go. Can I kick back with your Pokemon at my picnic for a bit? Uh, sure. Looks like you and your Pokemon got a good rest. Come on by and kick back anytime. Aww. Oh my god, I know you. You're a menace. And I adore you. This is gonna be difficult. Okay, we got him. Uh, I wanna add to the party, I think. How do I wanna switch? Oh, oh my god, I forgot how small pommies are. I know you. Oh my god, so cute. Okay. Focus.
good. Do we have a splink already? No, we don't. Oh no, Spoink, I'm sorry. We gotta find another one. And not kill it this time. What on earth are you? This must be new. Alright, I was thinking maybe a little more than that, but that's all right. There we go. Ew. I don't know if I have one of you yet, do I? Nope. In midair and everything. Um, maybe. Forty. Forty. Smooth always goes first. It's just stuff everywhere. Oh, don't mind me. Just looking for a way down. Oh, shit. Sorry, sorry. Kuhit is just standing behind us, casually watching the battle go down. What is that? A 
last point. Redemption. Oh my god. Ooh. You know, there are certain times where I really like being able to see the Pokemon out and about like this. With their, like, full cannon height and whatever. And then there are other times where it really scares me. Case in point. There's other stuff, but we should go heal first. Cute. Use a pee button to crouch. That I did know. Uh -huh. Alright, time to go find out what that big bright sparkly light is. I am curious. No, not that one. That one. Ooh, all right. I mean, whatever, I guess. Not the one though. There is another one. Oh, there it is. It just. Oh, so you had no problem running headlong off that cliff, but this one is too much? sparkly thing over over here and I would like to holy crap I want I want to get down there oh all right all around Paldea you'll spot gleaming crystals emitting brilliant beams of light. If you investigate one, you'll be able to take on a terror raid battle and try to defeat a powerful terror- Oh! Oh, is that what this is? <laughs> hmm. This doesn't look like a smart idea, which is such a shame. Because it looks fun. I feel like I want to go out of one of you. I don't think. 
Oh, I do. Sorry, young goose. My bad. There we go. I'll get some. I'm just right there, huh? Okay. Totally fine. Oh, there are little markers for things. Stardust. Uh, what's in that cave? Well, it was worth a shot. Thanks, anyway. new kid. I know what's up around here. Let me take a look at your Pokemon for you. Okay. Martina, go for it. Okay, that was legit hilarious. Was it? Your Pokemon's very hurt. Hmm. Is there Lilios around here? There must be. A stick. Middle of the road. Hi. Oh, I can just send you in any direction, huh? Oh. Oh, are you okay? You can do it. Wow, you super can't. Oh my gosh. Honey, what did you do? How did you manage that? Let's have a picnic again. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh. They didn't get Pikachu's voice actress. She's always in the games. Thank you. Let's see. You did it! Oh, that's so cool. That is so freaking cool. I'm still not entirely certain.
Yeah, I don't get that, but <gasps> is it happy? Oh my god, it is. Hello. Oh my god. Look at the baby. Ball. Yeah, alright. We don't really have a whole lot of options. I just don't want to hurt my baby to the point of making it faint. Yes. Yes! Oh my god. What a great day. Look at the baby. <laughs> Carefully carries a round white rock that it thinks is an egg. It's bothered by how curly its hair looks. What a sweetheart. Good job. Absolutely fascinated how Chikatita keeps getting his ass handed to him by a very small bird. Although, to be fair, Chikatita is a very small cat, so maybe I am expecting a little too much. an army. Wow, guys. Do it again. Hell yeah. Do it again. Oh my god. Hi, dude. Look at him go. Taking out everyone in the vicinity. Good for you, baby. Let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, really? Dang, look at you. No, here, honey. Oh boy. <laughs> That's okay. Blows my mind that those ones has no problem with whatsoever. But that little bird is just too much. Go get him. I mean, I'd be proud of you even if you couldn't do it. Hell yeah. Is that a Pokemon just sitting there? I know I 
what you're saying. Is it? Oh my god, it is. Oh, it's a coin. I think it was a Pokemon that was carrying a coin and I scared the Pokemon. This is wild. I am having a great time. It's definitely not a traditional Pokemon game. Ooh. But I am having fun. To be perfectly honest, that's kind of all I care about. Wh what? You can just go back up immediately once you've come down? That's kind of cool. Go pick up that with that Shinx. Yes. Good job. How about that one? How about that one? <laughs> oh, what about a spoink? Do you need a little spoink, dude? Fight you? You are very new. What is that? Char Cadet? Hi, Steph, how are you? Is it okay if I call you Steph? Or would you prefer that I call you something else? I never asked. Sorry about that. How are you today? Oof. I like Pokemon, I do too. Alright, I don't think, I think Spigatito might pass out. Oh, nope, alright. Maybe we can get away with this? We'll see. Yeah, usually in the afternoons, I've been playing, um, Usually in the afternoons I've been playing Pokemon Emerald, um, but I made a promise to myself that I would beat both Emerald and Violet before I started in on the next Pokemon game that I want to play. I don't know if it's good, but in New Leaf I sold my turnips for 312 bells each. That sounds pretty good to me. Just gonna keep throwing them at you, buddy. I don't know what to tell you. It's just gonna keep happening. I'm officially a turnip person. Hell yeah. I've been trying to sell my turnips. Yesterday did not work. Today didn't work. Hopefully tomorrow. I look pissed. Did you see us? Choose the next one. Come here, Makuhita. I am now determined. This is now a matter of principle. There it is. Thank you. Sweet. 
Okay. Now, oh, it's getting dark. I forgot that time doesn't work the same in this game as it does in the others. I did forget that. Was that a book? Um, yeah, so every time you get a new Pokemon, it adds their entry to the Pokedex. And I guess it's in the form of a book. And Gracie was there as well. Oh, I love Gracie. She's such a sweetheart. Okay, I'm gonna run to the bathroom. I will be right back. In the meantime, stuff, have, have you um, not played uh, Scarlet or Violet? I am back. She will finally build the shop. Hell yeah. No, I haven't played them. I wanted to get them, but I wasn't sure, so I got something else. That's totally fair. I'm honestly still unsure about how I feel about this game. It's definitely not... It's not like a traditional Pokemon game. And for that, I'm not super pleased. But, uh, like, I also appreciate that it's not trying to be like Pokemon has always been willing to just like go out on its own branch and experiment Pokemon Conquest on the DS is a great example of that I'm just not used to them doing it in the main branch if that makes sense Sorry, let me just pull up chat on my phone so that I can see. Heck yeah. I heard if you emulated it works amazingly. Does it really? <laughs> Heartbreakingly, uh, that doesn't surprise me. This game is... Well, it's something. I will say, it is very- this- this auto-battling feature, so fun. I think that that is so fun. So innovative. For Pokemon. <laughs> and so smart for them to put in. That you can just send it off to do its own thing. It also 
Okay. Makes it way easier to train. Oh no, not you. It is really funny to me, however, that Chikatito can take on all of these guys, have it not be a problem, but yeah, the second that happens, it's an immediate issue. Yes, I understand that there are going to be some people that are like, well, that's not what a Pokemon game is about. And that's fine. This is an option, not a requirement. You do not have to use this feature if you don't want to. Pokemon Violet uses too much power. Switch is a bit weak for it. That, I mean, that makes sense. I think, honestly, that the Switch is a wonderful console. Um, but I also think, you know, Pokemon, like, Nintendo, sorry, not Pokemon. Nintendo really likes to, like, make the best of the best. And that can be really hard when, you know, your console isn't quite up for it. I will, however, also say that, you know, Breath of the Wild exists. And that game looks just... Like, the graphics look fairly similar, I guess. Um, it looks just as good, if not better. So I did have kind of a hard time believing that. However, I, I do know that, you know, obviously, Pokemon needs things that Breath of the Wild never needed because it's a Zelda game. Like all these small little dudes. I think the Switch is super cool, but this game looks like it wasn't built for this console. <clears throat> I agree. I think... I don't know. I like... I think that this is a really cool game. And I just, are we gonna battle? And I like Nintendo in general. I mean, a lot of their policies are really shitty, but I like their games. I like what they make. I gotta tell you about this. It was all sparkly and twinkly. What? Oh, we gotta fight first now. I see. Here we go. OG Switch was released in 2017, and the only way to upgrade it was a bigger screen, real kickstand, and bigger battery. Yeah, I have the OG one. That's what I'm playing on. You're not wrong. You're definitely not. But I'm also, like... You know... I don't really know what went into it. And I'm not a game developer, so I don't... Now that we're all bruisey and loosey... Yeah, well... Wasn't really my fault, now was it, buddy? Get him. And I went afterwards. There you go. 
You picked. Yeah, I named it. Um, I named it Chikatita. And what a good cat you are. So cute. Yeah, no, I loved all of the starters. I think that they had some real, like, all of them were adorable. Um, and it did kind of hurt to pick one. Especially because in the intro, um, they let you run around with all three of them at the same time. So it was super heartbreaking to have to pick just one. But I did. They're wee cat, apple dragon, and fancy duck, right? Yeah, I, I guess that's one way to say it. Fancy apple doesn't have a single thought behind its eyes, though. Not a single one. Oh, shit. I forgot. Sorry. <clears throat> I have to find a different Pokemon to send out when we see the birds. Maybe Ralts? We do have a Ralts. I don't know if I can get to where you are. I'm always shake, so low shake. I adore you. Okay. Go get him. I know you know how. Good. Figure out how to get you to do this on your own. Hey, little Shanks proceeds to get. Yeah. Bad with names, so nicknames and simple explanations are the only way. I That's totally fair. I usually am too, but I think I remember their names. So I named this one Chica uh, Chikatita because Sprigatito reminded me of the ABBA song Chikatita. So that's his name. Um, I think the little fire apple was Fue Coco. And if I'm not mistaken, the duck was Duxley? Or something similar. There you go. Good luck. That's my boy. Look at him go. Yes. Yes! You've done it. You're amazing. You're wonderful. You're named it something stupid like Backyard because it's a grass cat. I think whatever name you choose for it would be just fine. I love just the, hey, general area. Come back. I don't want you picking a fight with that bird. You'll lose. Go get it. Honestly, usually I don't give them nicknames because I'm not a creative person. 
Chikatita was the only thing, and it was only because I like ABBA. Otherwise, I would have been screwed. So happy. So cute. I do think that it's for only a fraction of what we would have gotten for regularly battling it, but I, I don't I don't mind. It's fast and efficient. I mean look at it go. Oh yeah. Hello. Yes, please. <clears throat> I like picking simple names, same. Gonna lie now, I want to name a grass Pokemon backyard. You totally should. <laughs> we gotta get out of this area. Too many little bluebirds. That can beat the crap out of my poor little cat. I like giving nicknames because I like them to be personalized. That is so fair. Sometimes I'll do that. Not always. It depends. Oh. Oh, that is... That is new. Hello, Jigglypuff. Fuck, are you kidding me? That wasn't what I meant to do. Damn it. Well. It's my own fault. No one to blame but myself. I didn't realize the rookity was there. Will you fight with me, please? I don't know what makes you so glowy, but- Oh! Oh! Holy crap, what do you got on your head? You cannot catch a Pokemon while it's terrestrialized. You have to reduce its HP and break through its transformation first. Only then can you catch it. Oh yeah, you think you're special? I think I can do it too. Oh, not right now, apparently. Oh, now I can. Eh. There we go. Hell yeah. Fight. I've never done this. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Look at you! Maybe I have done this. I remember those flowers. <clears throat> oh, we're gonna sleep for a little while. Dang it. That's okay. We'll get back in eventually. And when we do... Search for a grass Pokemon. And hope they aren't from Violet or Scarlet. I'll be lurking for a bit. Sounds good, stuff. See you in a bit. Good luck on your Pokemon hunt. There we go. Hell yeah. Get over here, Jigglypuff. Join the crew. Darling, we're going to need to find you an Everstone. Because you are going to be a kitten forever. 
After my three minute search, I found only two worthy Pokemon, Weed Cat and Goat Thing from Pokemon Y. Goat Thing? Are you talking about like a deerling? It's a goat Pokemon. Hmm. Pokemon X and Y was one of my favorites. And I can't remember it off the top of my head. It's literally a grass goat. Interesting. <coughs> Excuse me. I have no idea which Pokemon that is. I'll give you the name. Okay. Just in this general direction. There you go. No, not there. Over here. Okay, so we are moving away. Skiddo? Skiddo is one of the worthy Pokemon to be named Backyard. God, even now, I... Can't think off the top of my head what that Pokemon looks like. I'll have to look it up after stream. Go that way. Yeah. There you go. <clears throat> Doing such a good job. Almost level 20, in fact. I will remind you about it next. Thank you. Yes, I will come back with a report on <laughs> whether or not I actually did what I said I was going to do. I'm sure I will. Because that's such an easy request. And it's not like I'll forget because we're already playing Pokemon. It's kind of on the forefront of my brain. Go for a sec to see how expensive is this game. Pokemon X and Y, that's in an interesting in-between spot where it might not be expensive at all. Because people probably aren't nostalgic for it just yet. So you might be able to get it for cheap. Oh, not X and Y. Okay. Oh, oh. You're talking about this game. Sorry. I think I have X, although maybe, no, no, I, I think I have Y too. It's a really good game. That's my favorite of the quote unquote new Pokemon games, is Pokemon X and Y. The one with the red thing, yeah, with the blue eyes. Yeah, that's the one I have, too. Come back here, Pongoose. Young Goose. Yeah, you don't get a pass. I have the red legendary on the title screen. Same. Okay. Let's start moving in this direction. Good job. We need to start actually making progress here. Where are we going? 
Artisan? Artisan. Pokemon Violet, yeah, it is. It's not cheap. That is for sure. Probably because it's a brand new game. Uh, where are you going? <gasps> Hello. It's the sound. It's dun dun da da dun. That's the sound of healing up at the Pokemon Center. You're right. Why are Switch games expensive? That's a great question. Oh, her eyes make me very uncomfortable. I think they're just too big. I think that it, it puts her in the Uncanny Valley area. Um, yeah, no, you know, I, like... Especially digital copies, it really kind of annoys me that digital copies are the same as physical copies. Because the production levels are not the same. <clears throat> they should be cheaper. She matches her Pokemon? You're right. She kind of does. I like how she looks like she's about to fight us. She's got like fisticuffs going. Guess I better go ask for another round of dun dun da da da. I guess so. Good job, baby. I hate that physical copies gives you less gold coins too. Oh, like at the Nintendo eShop thing. Go. Yeah. Alright, just this general vicinity. Go wild. Just don't fight any rickety's, please. Oh, gulpin. We haven't... We don't have one of those, I don't think. Nope. No, we don't. Alright, let's fix that. Oh, shoot. We got room for one more attack before he falls asleep. Okay, good. Also, you can only get the gold coins in the first two years of release, and then it doesn't give you coins anymore? Really? That's really weird. Am I supposed to love my physical collection in these conditions? <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah, Gulpin. We got it. And no, you're not. We've talked about this. Chikatita, you're not evolving. I tried to get some coins with an older game and it didn't give them to me. That's so weird. Ooh, if you set, select your profile from the app and various records from your adventure. Oh. Updated by taking photos. That's fun. Screw the Switch, I'm playing the 3DS now. I don't care if the eShop is closing. Also, 3DS online services are free. I That's the best part. I know, it did kind of break my heart a little bit when I, like, got the Switch and you, like, have to pay. I mean, it's not that it costs that much. It's just, you know, 
that you could do it before for free, so why is it suddenly... Oh. Hey, Jade. So from what I can gather, the Stony Cliff Titan likes to lurk somewhere in this rocky area. I had to look around, but I couldn't find any trace of it. Maybe it's way up high on a cliff or something? Nah, that's impossible. I don't think it'd be hiding somewhere that tricky, so don't go falling off any cliffs or trying anything or anything trying to search out somewhere too strange. Maybe just give your map app a look if you're feeling stumped. It's pretty handy. Okay, thanks, Arvin. Yeah, that is dumb. I remember I chose my Pokemon starter in Pokemon Y. Which one did you choose? I don't even remember what the starters were. Which is very embarrassing. Go. Go do whatever, honey. Hello. Pokemon League rep. You have three trainers. Once you've defeated six, you'll get a lovely prize. Cool. Sign me up. Go where are you going? Pony is right there. It's a fire fox. Grass one that is hated and the water frog. Oh, that's right. Fennec. I had Fennec the fire fox. <clears throat> Where did you go? Why are you leaving like that? There are Pokemon right here. There you go. Take down this entire gang of shanks. Hell yeah. Look at that. Oh, yup. Yup. So really reaching for the stars, huh? Good job. I don't know why the grass one is hated. I like it. The metal evolution is shit, but the rest is fine. This is once again something I'm going to have to look up because I don't remember what they looked like. Now that you've mentioned it, like, I remember Fennec. But I think that that's only because that was the starter I chose. Hello. Are you rich or a businessman? Battle me, for I'm... I have given my Pokemon a mighty item to hold. And I am mighty. Okay. Severino? The office worker. Yep, alright. I knew it. It's either gonna be, like office man or like rich boy whatever <clears throat> I would have chosen it but I remembered how much I struggle with getting fire Pokemon so I just chose the easy option this guy looks like a horror movie guy he does Stockpile? I don't understand what that move is. Probably because I've never given it to any of my Pokemon. But he's the one that goes after you? Yeah, like, um, like American Psycho. Wow, like everyone leveled up. I love that the pig's name is LeChonk. Purchase the target, then steals the target's held item. That's so funny. Hell yeah, you can learn it. I will go and see what stockpiled it. I appreciate you. You don't have to. If you do not want to. Pony yeah, you can learn dig. Different growl. Oh, Skiddo! 
Oh. Steph, this is the one you were telling me about. I agree. Backyard is a great name for that Pokemon. Oh, it's so cute. I remember it now that I'm seeing it. I forgot what its name was, though. Oh, so cute. I didn't even have to search. The game did my work for me. So helpful. It is so cute. You know, if my parents weren't lying to me, my uncle used to own a goat named Rambo. And he was really mean. <laughs> and my uncle really, really loved having him. My might and my items are nothing in the face of a mighty trainer like you. That's right, bitch. Oh, yeah, you can evolve, Fletchling. Go for it. Um, yeah, my uncle used to have a goat named Rambo. And then, uh... I, I believe that they had to give him away when, uh, when my aunt found out that she was pregnant with my cousin because they didn't, you know, they didn't want to uh, have a unfriendly goat and a small child at the same time. For some research, I discovered that stockpile is meant to be used with an- Oh! Okay, it's probably good for, like, double bottles. I see. Like, Plusel and Minin when they do the, like, helping hands move. Flame charge? Hell yeah, you can! What are we getting rid of? Growl. Immediately growl. Like, it's energy, and you use the other move. Gotcha, okay. So it's like you use that one first, and then you- Like, focus energy. When you store up energy, and then you use it. You use another move to get the energy out. Yes, please. You can only stock three max. Interesting. Yeah, that's a move that's been around for a while, and I've never used it. Oh, okay. You may sometimes see Pokemon icons on your map. When you do, it means you may be able to find those Pokemon in the area, so try to search them out. Ooh, I didn't know that. Thank you, lady. Appreciate you and your help. Fight the Shanks. Yes. After more scrolling, I discovered that now it raises your defense, too. In Gen 3, it only stocked energy. Oh. Ah. Why are there so many rookities? Get away. Oh, wow. Oh, Olivia! Oh, I love these little guys. Do we have one already? No? Hell yeah, here we go. I chose the wrong Pokemon to go into this battle with because you are fire and I am grass. That's okay. We might be screwed. We're gonna keep going though. Ouch. Ooh! Ooh! Ow! Alright. Okay. Uh... You.
We might not need it though. We might be okay. Secondary moves are split up and swallow. Oh. Interesting. Okay, this one I'm going to give a nickname to, but only because I have a cat named Leo. And that's honestly it. I just, I have a cat named Leo and I would like to name this one also Leo. He looks nothing like this, mind you. But that's okay. This is the research I have done. Well, thank you so much for your research, Steph. I really appreciate it. I kind of want to add him to the party. Who do I swap him out for? You know what? Actually, no, I don't want to add him to the party. Not right now. Leo, you head elsewhere for the moment, buddy. I'm gonna come back and get us a mosquito as well. Not yet, though. Pokemon is kinda a cat, yeah. Walt's well, name is also Litleo. So it felt correct. But yeah, no, that that bit, it, Lit Leos do not look like my Leo. For one, Leo's primary color is white. For two, he doesn't have a tail. For three, he's very fluffy. And he's got blue eyes. Should I not know everything? Should I need to go adventuring? Well, thank you. I appreciate all of your help, baby. Oh, that one too? Hmm, okay. Then let's, uh, let's heal really quick. Oh, what did I do? No. 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 Leave me alone. Smart Pokemon person now. I know what Stockpile does. That, that honestly is probably like gives you bragging rights or something because I didn't know what it meant and I've been here since the beginning oh yes here we go go get him baby Uh, no, do not come near me. Get the other one. Where are you going? He's right there. There. Oh my god. A deer. I forget what your name is, but you're cool. Sweet cat. The Shink serial killer, that's right. Stantland, that's your name. Thank you. You can do this. Even if it's trying to make you miss every single time. If I'm not mistaken, magical leaf. <clears throat> it said never misses? Here we go. Fuck you and your sand. Oh man. 
Oh, he's mad at us. He's very mad at us. Have you tried Arceus? I have. I don't have it, but I'm curious. It was fine. Um, it definitely didn't stand out in my mind. But it definitely tried to. It was a cute game. It just, like... I don't know. I didn't really want to go out of my way to play it or anything. Mm -hmm. I can taste those ground pixels. Apart from the stomping. We're trying, we're trying. I just don't want to kill him, you know? I might have to. I might have to. Um, I don't think Bite will kill him. That's right. My accuracy can't go any lower, and yet I haven't missed a single thing I've thrown at you. The Pokeballs don't count. You are ridiculous. Bro, just get in the ball! That mountain's in the background totally don't look like Roblox preset. No, of course not. I see, unfortunately, we're both stubborn. So close. Yes, okay, so you've knocked out Chikatita, however. The more this game looks to be fan made using presets only. It's interesting because the stuff behind me doesn't look too bad. But the stuff behind Stantler. It's like a challenge. Try to make a Pokemon game using only presets, and I think they successfully did it. It's interesting because when I first saw the game, I was like, Get it, I don't get why everyone's so mad at it. But like the more I see them I'm like oh Oh I get it. Oh my god, fine. If you won't come with me, then we're killing you. You understand? Bitch. How dare you. The more you look, the more you don't want to look. Exactly. No, man. What is wrong with you? All I want to do is put you in a ball for the rest of your life. Him, but you know what? We didn't need him. That guy sucks. Ground pixels is a main dish, and our shadow pixels is dessert. <laughs> hello, hello. Please kill them. I made a mistake. 
Thank you. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, go get him. Let him know. <laughs> I mean, no. <clears throat> it's like you try to play a game that needs a lot of power on a four-year-old phone, and it and it works, but does it? Yeah. No, I guess that is what it's like, more or less. Oh well. Another coin. What the fuck is that? Hi, talk to me, what are you? I'm scared of you, I think. Anger show. Okay. Alright, that's a bit much. My love, this is the best Pokemon. Oh, is it? <sighs> that sound that came out of it. Oh my goodness. Well, we've got one. I love this guy. I don't think we're supposed to be standing that high up off the ground. Um, maybe? Want to teleport to? Sure, it would be funny to switch growl. Ah <clears throat> oh, yes, Minecraft X-Ray Hacks. I was thinking more of like, uh, oh, sorry, Cloth. No, I actually really like his name, Cloth. I think that's really funny. Hell yeah, Cloth. Oh, no, 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 I didn't want to. No. I mean, we don't really need two fire types. Even though I really do like Pony. He's super cute. Yeah, it's got that sonic fucking glitch issue. You know the one. It's down there. Okay. More of the same. I came over here because that was an item. Hold on. I guess I already picked it up. Wait, what? It's right there. There you go. You got it, you got it. I don't know the Sonic issue. There's a lot of them. To save time, there's a lot of issues with the, the recent Sonic games. Challenged by Benjamin the student. Alright, Ben, let's go. Oh. The sun burn. Goodbye. I'll do research for that tomorrow, probably. Yeah, you've done plenty of research for today. More than enough. Alright, Bonsley. Guess what? Rude. I could.
couldn't have escaped anyway. This is a battle, you moron. Hell yeah. I lost? I didn't see that coming at all. Sorry. I'm really wondering if Nintendo would make a new console, what it would be. I don't know, that's a great question. I mean, like, that's one of the great things about Nintendo, is that they are so ready to innovate, that they're not afraid to try new things. Like, the Switch is incredible. I Like, I know that it's not perfect, obviously. But having something that's both a portable and an at-home console is insane. That's incredible. And I love that they took that risk and really went for it because it paid off. Yes, with free online services. If it has that, I will buy it instantly. Understandable. Yeah, my Switch was a gift. I got it the day it came out. And I still remember where I was when I got it because it was the late Christmas gift and it came from my dad um cause he worked with GameStop at the time and so he had told me he was like hey as your Christmas gift I'm getting you this thing but it's not out yet and I was like okay I remember the day that he came to bring it to me. I was, God, I was at like, the, like I was at CVS store. I don't know why, but I was. And um, it was snowing. I remember that it was snowing when I got my Switch. Okay. Buy it before it's released. I got it as an Easter gift, I remember the game. Got home, but the console still wasn't. It happened. I'm like, oh, gotcha. <clears throat> you yeah, know, I remember when I first got mine, the console was so new that the only game that I had for it for quite a while was Breath of the Wild. Because it was the only one that really stood out to me. <gasps> Who are you? That looks like Leo. Oh, kind of. Leo doesn't have a tail. But. It's the spot. Fuel for more adventuring here. Have some ingredients. Thanks. Totally unrelated, but I heard there's a cliff face that moves. I wonder if it's true. You should take a breather. Good idea. That's a dog. It is a dog. But it looks more like my cat than the lion cub Pokemon did. Oh boy, get back here. So ah! Jesus, don't do that to me! Holy shit! <laughs> that scared me! Oh! <clears throat> okay. It's from Pokemon Sun. Oh, okay. Cloth. You. You fright me. Why are there so many of you? Sounds like a constipated animal. I think it sounds like a foghorn from a ship. Okay. I'm curious. Am I just... 
send you out into the world, would you win or would Claw? You would win. That's good to know. Rip cloth. <clears throat> what is this? Oh, is this an observatory? Hell yeah. The weed killer strikes again. A metronome! Metronome is both the best and worst move. But I like it. I think it's great. Woo! It's a chemical. Oh, you're a ghost type! I see. That didn't occur to me for some reason. Be fixed with this. Yeah. There we go. Climb that fast, yeah. <clears throat> to be fair, it's it's because I was holding down the B button, which made me go faster. Oh. I wanna be friends, please? Please? Yes. Pokemon, you evolve by getting all the coins? I have no idea. I have no context for this Pokemon. This is genuinely the first time this game is the first time I've ever seen this Pokemon. Oh, you can use normal moves, but I can't? Hmm. I didn't know the running shoes worked on the ladder. I knew that did I, until I held down B for fun. And they worked. We got him. It was inside an old treasure chest. Sometimes it gets left in shop corners, since no one realizes it's actually a Pokemon. That's so cute. All right. Let me help me up there. Get literally everything. Ugh. Oh, is that where we're headed? That looks like a mess. Well, I guess that's where we're headed, but it's gonna have to wait for tomorrow or something, because I unfortunately have other stuff to do. I'm scared of how many Pokemon will exist in like five years. Same. Very. There were only like 151 when I first got here. When the whole thing started. But anyway, maybe I will play something tonight? I haven't decided yet. Kind of depends on how I'm feeling. But thank you for hanging out. I hope that you have a good rest of your day. And maybe I'll see you later. It's 10 p.m. here. Oh, wow. It is late for you. It is only 3 p.m. here. So <laughs> I hope that you have a good night in that case. Bye, Steph. Thanks for hanging out.